The Accommodation Association of Australia, the united face of our industry. One voice that has come into being through more than 40 years of evolution. In many ways, the history of the association is closely entwined with the development of the Australian accommodation industry as a whole, and, in a sense, the two have grown up together. It was the emergence of the motel in Australia during the 1950s that led to the creation of the first accommodation association. By the late 50s, the Australian motel industry had gained significant momentum and the travelling public were demanding more and more motel accommodation. It was quickly recognised that the industry needed an independent standards organisation to champion the broader interests of the sector. In 1969, the Motor Inn and Motel Association was formed to represent the interests of a rapidly growing industry. The association has, from the very early days, always been member-owned. By the early 70s, an increasingly affluent travelling public were looking for a better class of motel. This demand resulted in the Motor Inn, which in most cases were larger establishments built in urban centres. Some Motor Inns were characterised by multi-storey buildings with undercover parking. In the late 1970s and early 80s, the development of upmarket boutique hotels and guest houses offered a different experience. Timeshare began to reinvent itself for a new wave of tourist growth, and the tourist park sector diversified their accommodation experience with the introduction of luxury self-contained cabins and villas. The expansion of the airline industry also led to a demand for new five-star hotels, which began to proliferate in capital cities. Due to these substantial changes in the accommodation industry, in 1991 the association changed its name to the Motor Inn Motel and Accommodation Association. During the late 90s, in order to better reflect both the ongoing state and federal industrial award changes and the broadening spread of sector membership, the association again underwent a name change, now becoming known as the Hotel, Motel and Accommodation Association or HMAA. The biggest change in the history of the association occurred in 2005 and 2006 with the consolidation of the state-based network into one truly national organisation. In 2011, the association took the next step in its evolutionary journey towards a unified industry body with the rebranding of the association as the Accommodation Association of Australia. For I think almost 25 years now we've been working towards having one organisation that represents the accommodation uh, industry and at last uh, we've achieved that. The Accommodation Association of Australia is going to give us a single voice for the largest sector of tourism, which is accommodation. The Accommodation Association now has approximately 2,000 member properties and represents a cross-section of industry members including motels, resorts, apartments, hotels, bed and breakfasts, backpackers, caravan parks and timeshares in both metropolitan and regional Australia. The association also represents single independent operators and forms partnerships for life. As the Accommodation Association, we do have that one voice, that one industry that we can now take to government, that we can talk on all facets of accommodation. It doesn't matter if you're the smallest B&B or you're the major city hotel, that you have a voice and you have a body that's going to represent you. I think that's the wonderful thing about the Accommodation Association, that we're all under the same umbrella and we're all moving in the same direction together with a united voice and with a single vision. And that's really fantastic. United, the Accommodation Association of Australia is ready to lead the industry into the future with one voice and one vision.